think it's just a case of the rich get richer and the poor get poorer. And that's how certain people at the top of the table like it, you know. I think the system's designed to keep certain people in a certain position. You know, they're not supposed to get no higher in a certain position. I think that's just how the, how the world's regulated. And there's a few people at the top of the table who's eating good. Certain people who you told the line they can eat a little. The rest of us are just working bees, just like cattle. You know, we run up and down, we feed the establishment, the establishment gives us the crumbs at the table. I mean, like, all the way through history, you can see signs of it. Do you know what I mean? If you look at, you look at things like, um, like electricity, energy, and kind of things, we're not supposed to be paying for that. Yeah? I mean, why is it Nik Nikolai Tesla? If you look it up, Nikolai Tesla, Nikolai Tesla, yeah, created free energy. He was going to give it to the world. Yeah? Certain people did everything in their power to make sure that he couldn't give it to us. They went with a dude named Edison. Yeah? The only reason they went with Edison is designed because Edison is designed, was designed to make money for those elite. Yeah? For those people who run big businesses, sure companies and stuff like that. Yeah? That's the only reason why we're paying for electricity now. So if you see it on that scale, when you look at things like that, it shows you. Yeah, there is, there's, a, there's a grand design to things. And from a bird's eye view, you can see it. From while you're in it, you're not going to see it. So if you yeah, the youth, the youth, the youth of the day needs to start thinking. Yeah, they need to start studying, they need to start, 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 you know, getting an education, you start with an education, the foundation is of education. Yeah, and you gain knowledge. As you gain knowledge, yeah, you gain power. So they say knowledge is power. You know, if you look at your history, see how things go, see how things went, and then, then you might be able to see where things are headed. You know? It's like it's been said at the end of the day when there's going to be a war. The only person who profits is the person who owns the bullets and the bandages, you know. They create, create a crisis, yeah, so they come up with a solution. And everyone's grateful for the solution to the crisis they created. People need to wake up. Yeah, see things how it is instead of fighting amongst themselves. Everyone's got scraps, everyone's fighting over the scraps, yeah. Instead of realising who it is, just flinging the scraps down to you to fight over. You know? Yeah, well, at the same time, I think governments, certain governments, are, you know what I mean? They're just like, like puppets, you know? There's other people pulling their strings. So yeah, we can blame the government, but at the end of the day, if they're not exactly who you're blaming them, why you're blaming them? You know what I mean? They're being controlled like everybody else, really. Everyone, yeah, everyone says, everyone says the problem, yeah, it's not every problem that you can throw money at and fix. You know, there's deeper rooted issues when it comes to the kids. You know what I mean? They, they, they feel like an abandoned nation when you think about it. Yeah, they've been left out in the cold. You know what I mean? What's left for them? So that's probably how they see it. You know what I mean, everyone's done everything they did. And what's left for the youth? Offer to, to grab what they can. I just, any message I have to the youth, to the youth then, I'll tell them to just maintain. You know? Knowledge. Yeah? Forwards, always. Always move forwards. Never try to look backwards, you understand me? Don't be distracted by things on the side. Yeah, just focus, move forwards. Progression, yeah, not ascension.